Good morning, class. Let us pray first. Thank you. Now, let us check the attendance. Class monitor, do we have any absentees today? Before you take your seat, please pick up the pieces of paper under your chair. Okay, thank you. So, class, how's your weekend? Mm -hmm. That's good. Have you enjoyed your weekend bending with your family? That's good to know. For this morning, our discussion will be in relation to a family. Are you familiar with Barney's I Love You song? Okay, that's good. So are you ready to sing and have fun today? Okay, let us sing I Love You by Barney. I love you, you love me. We are happy family with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Hope you say you love me too. I love you, you love me. We are happy family with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Hope you say you love me too. Okay, class. Now, what can you say about the song? Okay, does it tell something important that we have already forgotten to do nowadays? How could you say so, John? Mm. That was a very good explanation. You know what, class? The song simply tells us something that we should always consider for us to keep our family or relationship with others interact. Sometimes showing affection or love towards a person makes him feel that he is appreciated and there will be feeling of belongingness and love. Okay, what else have you noticed which made you conclude that the song is all about love? Okay. Everybody had just sung it very well. It's now time to improve your pronunciation more. What do you see in a pictures A and B? When was the last time you gave a gift to your mother? Why do you think there is a cake? What do you think is the celebration? Okay, aside from giving material gifts, how else did you show your love for your mother? Let us read a poem and let us find out how the children show their love for their mother. Okay, here's the poem. Who loves mother's best? Oh, happy birthday, mama dear. Song Ben. Least and best we cheer. We love you so much. We love you too. They kiss their mother, hug her too. Then quickly Ben skipped out to play and went to playmates all the day. Then rushed home in time to see his sister Liz aglow with glee. For Liz held up an ice cream cone, enjoying it she sat alone. Ben grabbed the cone and slipped away. So Liz cried out, for that you'll pay. Like, ca like cats and dogs, the two did struggle, each making sure to win the battle. They tried to push and then to pull, while Mama almost lost her cool. But little best with Mom she stayed. She set the table, drinks she laid, and helped serve Mom's friends and guests. Now tell me, who loves mothers best? So after reading the poem, let us now answer these questions. Okay, first question, why did Bess and Ben and Liz kiss and hug their mother? Okay, why was Liz aglow with glee? Very good. What made Liz cry out? For that you'll pay. Okay, excellent. Why did mother almost lost her cool? Who among the three children loved their mother best? How did she show it? Okay. What is the best way to show your love for your parents? Okay. Thank you. Excellent. 
What happened to Liz when she was eating a cone of ice cream? Okay, look again at the picture. What do you notice on Liz's face? Why was Liz a glow with glee? Okay, so, and that's what we call the cause and effect relationship. So, a cause and effect relationship describes something that happens and why it happens. What happens is called the effect and why it happens is called the cause. The cause is usually introduced with the connected because. So again, I'll be grouping you into four groups. And then, so each group will act out of the following situations from the poem. So, if you really do understand our topic for today, I want you to answer this on your one for sheet of paper. Okay, this is the direction. Read the following sentences. Write C before the sentence for the cause and write E for the part that is the effect. Okay, time is up. Um, we will be checking that activity tomorrow so for your assignment i want you to read this short fable so you have to underline the cause and then circle the effect so i guess that's all for today see you again tomorrow